What is CHIRP technology? CHIRP is an acronym for Compressed High Intensity Radar Pulse. CHIRP techniques have been used for a number of years above the water in many commercial and military radar systems. The techniques used to create an electromagnetic CHIRP pulse have been modified and adapted to commercial acoustic imaging sonar systems. TriTech has introduced CHIRP as its core acoustic engine for all its range of digital sonar technology, DST sonars. The DST technology enables the use of the CHIRP technique for certain products. Products that use TriTech's CHIRP technology can be identified by the DST label. Conventional monotonic techniques. To understand the benefits of using CHIRP techniques, we need to analyse the limitations using conventional monotonic techniques. An acoustic pulse consists of an on-off switch modulating the amplitude of a single carrier frequency. The ability of the acoustic system to resolve targets is determined by pulse length. This however has its drawbacks. To get enough acoustic energy into the water for good target identification and over a wide variety of ranges, the transmission pulse length has to be relatively long. For monotonic acoustic technique, the following occurs during the transmission and receiving of acoustic data. Step 1. The electronically generated single frequency signal is produced. Step 2. The signal is amplified and passed to the transducer. Step 3. The transducer changes the electrical signal into an acoustic pulse or ping. Step 4. The ping passes through the water. If there is a target, the ping will be reflected back to the transducer. Step 5. The transducer changes the reflected acoustic signal back into an electrical signal. Step 6. The signal is then amplified. Step 7. The target is displayed onto the sonar screen. The equation for determining the range resolution of a conventional monotonic acoustic system is given by the following equation. In a conventional TriTech system, the smallest pulse length is 50 microseconds and the velocity of sound is 1500 meters per second, typical. Therefore, the range resolution equals 37.5 millimeters. This result effectively determines the range resolution or ability to resolve separate targets of the monotonic acoustic imaging system. Using the example shown, if two targets are less than 37.5 mm apart, then they cannot be distinguished from each other. The net effect is that the system will display a single large target rather than multiple smaller targets. Chirp technology. Instead of using a burst of a single carrier frequency, the frequency within the burst is swept over a broad range throughout the duration of the transmission pulse. For the chirp acoustic technique, the following occurs during the transmission and receiving of acoustic data. Step 1. The electronically generated multiple frequency chirp signal is produced. For steps 2 to 6, the principle of operation is the same as a monotonic sonar. Step 7. A sharp spike is reduced on return of an acoustic pulse. This creates a signature acoustic pulse from which the sonar uses pattern matching techniques to look for its own unique signature being echoed back from its targets. In the chirp system, the critical factor determining range resolution is now the bandwidth of the chirp pulse. Now the range resolution is given by the following equation. The bandwidth of a typical TriTech chirp system is 100 kHz with a velocity of sound of 1500 meters per second, typical. The new range resolution is 7.5 millimeters, a theoretical improvement by a factor of five. Chirp examples. To further demonstrate chirp technology, here are two examples of log data captured with side scan and mechanically scanning imaging chirp sonars. The first captured on the Plymouth sound using a Torfish 325 kilohertz DST side scan sonar. This shows an Admiralty Boys mooring chain. Here you can make out the individual chain links and the Boys concrete sinker. The second log data file shows 
data captured in London's Queen Victoria dock using the Seeking DST V6 mechanically scanning imaging sonar. Here, Tritex Seeking is shown giving an image of the pontoon. The pile supporting the dock side and the acoustic zoom tool showing a lobster pot dropped into the dock to give a strong sonar target. This also demonstrates the resolution of the chirp sonar. In summary, chirp techniques combined with Tritex DST design gives greatly improved range resolution compared to fixed frequency sonars, larger transmission pulse lengths for increased operating ranges, improved discrimination between closely spaced targets, improved noise rejection and signal to noise ratios, and finally reduced power consumption from high speed digital circuitry. That was What is Chirp Technology? We hope you enjoyed watching this training video. For more information on our training, contact training at tritech.co.uk or visit our website at www.tritech.co.uk.